Hey everybody, here's a video demo of a, a homemade amp I put together. Started off as a bit of a just a fun project, a bit of a crazy project, but it ended up sounding really good. So I thought I'd show you on a YouTube video. Okay, first of all we've made it in the classic sort of wedge style there. It's got a bit, a bit of a lean up to the player, which I always really like. Here's the panel of what used to be the front of the hi-fi system. You can see its display in there. Uh, volume knob with the LED on the back, angry face on it, very important. And I haven't installed buttons yet, so what I'm doing is just putting a AAA battery in there and bang, I can change all the settings. You see the screen changing there on the equalizer settings. And there's a few other settings you can change as well, like surround sound. Um, um, also, you got your mic inputs there and two uh, input volume control controllers for each of the corresponding mic sockets. So I've used my daughter's fancy little stickers there just to give me an idea of what all these sockets actually do. Um, what else have we got? Zero one at the bottom is of course off on, and there's a headphone socket at the bottom there too. And this is the important bit though: two Arista dual cone, really high quality speakers. They're 80 watts each, and let's have a listen to how they sound. Let's set this camera up so it's nice and straight, and you can see what's going on. Start off at low volume. Might try off with a bit more of a conventional patch. Alright, like that. Trouble now. So yeah, it's a nice warm sound. It's a really very authentic um, replication of what the multi effect system I'm using is pushing out. Um, like I said, there's a volume boost at the back of the amp way over there, and that's on about I was playing on about two thirds volume there. So there's quite a lot of headroom still left in it. Um, certainly loud enough for uh, any kind of practice session. Let's go full power. I'm not sure if you could see the movement there in the speakers uh, with those bass notes, but pretty steady there. Woven fibre uh, speakers, which also won't show up on the uh, on this camera's view. But yeah, they're good quality stuff. So I'm pretty happy with this amp. Like I said, it started off as just an amusing project. It turned out to be something um, really, really good, I think. Pat on the back for me.